Hit his area with 51. Everything in the butterflies. Go get your man. And I feel like butterfly gonna recap this. So all oh, y'all wanna know what happened. I'm gonna tell you what happened. He got you already know what it is, man. Salute to the subscribers, that notification gang, etc., etc. Don't let none of that get too far ahead of you. You know who I be. Follow me on IG. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo. There's a couple things I want to speak about today in regards to this whole piranha bags and body situation. Him, the, the, the scuffle, the Green Ranger. Your wish is my command, Empress. Tommy, the red, the red ranger, the black ranger, the pink ranger, um, and Hitman, and putting out this footage, guns getting involved, uh, it's a, it's a lot, and I don't know where to start, so I want to start here, right, first of all, don't, don't nobody call me, don't nobody text me, don't nobody DM me, none of you battle rapper niggas say something to me, I'm too, I'm serious too, I'm talking to him, and you niggas be sensitive, and I'm saying the truth, leave me alone, I like most of y'all. Don't nobody hit me up. I don't want to hear nothing from none of y'all. I don't want to hear nothing from nobody. I don't be at none of the premieres. I'm not involved with this process. I don't have nothing to do with it. So my opinion is based off of the things that I see. I, I'm not in the house. I don't know where the house has been. I don't want to be. I like to do my own thing. So I get it when they have these things and people get invited and all this premieres and shit. I be cool not being involved. You know why? Because when this type of stuff happens, I can say whatever I want and ain't nobody going I would say whatever I want even if I was invited. I gotta listen to this nigga. Don't listen to this nigga. Don't listen to this nigga. This nigga ain't got no sense. Jacket from Chrome and I still say whatever the fuck I want. So I be telling people, don't appease me. Don't appease to me because I'm not worth it. Because you're going to do something for me that you consider nice. And then when something goes left, I'm going to talk about it. So there's no need for you to, you know what I'm saying? Don't invite me. Don't fly me down. Because I'm going to say what the fuck I want. Um... Got a lot of respect for Hitman. I ran into Hitman like last year sometime in um, Waffle House after one of the RBE events. Cool dude. I respect his business. I respect what he's got going on. You know what I'm saying? We ain't friends or nothing like that, but we're not, I'm not an enemy of his either. It's just I call it like I call it. I don't subscribe. I'm not a groupie. I'm not going to be in nobody's pocket. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is. I just say what I want, and that's the end of it. You know what I mean? So, and that's with any artist. You know what I'm saying? I rock with rock. If rock lose a battle, I'm going to tell him he lose a fucking battle. I rock with other people. If they lose, I'm going to tell them they lose. If they wrong, Danny's my guy. Y'all want to know what happened? He got smoke. Came off a slogan from him. But he's not that thick skin. So if I get in, if I go in on him and say he lost, whatever the case may be, he's still going to answer the phone. He's still going to pick up. He's still going to, you know, talk to me about battle rap and give me his opinions on things. So, you know, there's some people who's for it and other people that's not. So I feel like, personally, if I talk about Hitman and if I'm not in the most positive connotation, I'm going to wind up not following him on Twitter no more. I'm going to make, he going to make me unfollow him or whatever the case may be. So I don't get involved. I don't want to, that's why. So I just, let's, let's start there. You know what I'm saying? I'm just start there. So, Bags and Bodies came around last year. I spoke about it just a little bit because, you know, it's a pilot. They're trying to shoot this show. And... It wasn't really progressing enough, and I had heard who won, and I had mentioned it. You know what I'm saying? I just mentioned it in passing. Bro, I was getting DMs, calls, all this shit. Please, get out of here. Get out of here, man. Shit, you know what I'm saying? Get in Ibu. Yo, you ruining the daddy. So I just left it alone. I never spoke about it again. I said, you know what? Let them niggas do them. If something comes up that's noteworthy to talk about, I'll talk about it. If not, not. Nah. So they had the uh, initiation joint. When they was having like the beginning battles and shit like that, and it was uh, Piranha versus Funeral Fame and a couple other joints, and I had watched them, and some of them niggas was nice. I thought Piranha was dope. I thought Piranha had some skills, and he eventually got himself inside the uh, the house. Now, to Hitman's credit, I heard a lot of the things that he had heard and what he was getting told to: don't book this nigga, don't bring him to your house, don't have him in your environment. He is a wild card. He's running around events. He was chasing, you know what I'm saying? And we could put it all on the table. You know, I heard he was running through a U all event after the MC with a ratchet. I heard he was going to air out an event with, with, with some of the URL staff. I heard he was going to let it air at, at Beasley and Pete. Bro, this is too much. This is too much. Too much. No mas. No mas. What the fuck you got going on where it's always some drama, always some beef? And I heard, and I'll tell you what it was. I heard Piranha's beef. With URL was because he wanted to battle T Top, and ain't no fucking way, he, like boy. he felt like he deserved bigger no names because he had been around forever. Well, just because you've been no around way, forever boy. and you haven't been putting forth the requisite work of other people doesn't mean you deserve the things that they get. 
So I heard that he was supposed to battle uh, T-Top, right? He won the battle T-Top, and he was like, T-Top accepted the battle. And URL was like, nah, we're not doing that. You know what I'm saying? And then I ain't gonna hold you. I don't blame him. I don't fucking blame him. I don't blame him. I'm not here to make no friends in this blog. Only friend I care about is Showtime SP in Battle Rap. So I know they wasn't gonna book that. Cause yeah, T-Top will take you. He'll battle you tomorrow, but he's gonna charge them niggas three times the price. Yo, if I battle for 10, I need 15. Who is he? He's done nothing. So an artist will tell you that yeah, I'm gonna take him. Yeah, they'll take you. But at what cost? It's gonna cost so much that it's not even gonna be worth it. Matter of fact, salute to URL and everybody over there. If I would've seen this nigga's name on a card against T-Top, I would've been looking at y'all crazy. Like, what the fuck y'all got going on over here? Why did he, what did he do to deserve this? This nigga ain't even been through the middle stages yet. He ain't even been through the super fight level and Born Legacy and Survivor Series. He ain't even been through that little, little run of the mill yet. At least you got beat some niggas down there. We ain't gonna battle niggas like, you know what I'm saying? No, no, I'm not gonna nobody. Hey, hey, hey. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We ain't gonna battle none of them niggas. We ain't gonna battle these niggas. You know what I'm saying? You ain't gonna battle none of them niggas. And you supposed to just get T Top? Nigga, I ain't seen you versus Emerson Kennedy yet. I ain't seen you versus Ryder. I ain't seen you versus none of these niggas. And you supposed to just jump and go straight to the next level? You bugging. So, anyway, uh, and like I said, I ain't got no beef with Piranha either. I follow the nigga on Twitter. I follow him on Instagram. He does the same with me. You ain't got to unfollow me. You ain't got to block me because I'm going to call like I call so I can't spoil it. This is what it is, my nigga. This is just big homie talking from big homie perspective, my nigga. It is what it is. So, <sighs> Hitman Holler brings you into the house. You get into situations with people. You want to fight the one dude. Uh, Yogi is his name, and then you want to, uh, and then, and then Green Ranger, whoa, whoa, the motherfucker, Green Ranger, Tommy the Green Ranger, the Green Ranger comes after you, nigga, and you know what, I blame Hitman Holler, because if you watch his battle versus Bill Collector, he said, I used the Tommy to get the white like the Green Ranger, nigga, you predicted this shit, he said, I used the Tommy to get the white like the Green Ranger, I wish I had that clip, I don't feel like going to get it, but you said it, so you predicted this shit, so, yo, let me tell y'all niggas something, B. I've been alive for a while, and I hope to stay alive for a long, longer time, you know what I'm saying? As long as God blesses me and keeps me in his humble abundance and his grace and spirit and mercy. In my life, my nigga, you never fight niggas that have dreadlocks that are like green or purple or blue. These niggas don't got too much sense. This nigga, yo, you don't fight niggas like that. When a nigga says, I want to test your might and start banging their own up, bro, you don't fight them type of niggas. See? You battle rap niggas not like that? Hey, where I'm from, from, nigga? <laughs> Fuck wrong with you? Ain't no fight when it's real beef, man. Real. Let them niggas be, son. You never fight them niggas, bro. Let them go. You don't fight. Listen, okay. And once a nigga tear off their own t-shirt, he has no regard for human life. This nigga's willing to tear his own t-shirt. I don't be tearing under my clothes. When a nigga wanna tear off their own t-shirt, man, you just say, fuck it, let it go. Now, Piranha, and seen the footage? You was definitely doing the Richard Sherman. You was backpedaling. You was doom doom doom. You was backpedaling, my nigga. I've been through, nigga. Right. Fuck wrong with you. Right. Where you think this energy come I've from, been nigga? I've shot twice, bro. Nah, nigga. Boy. You ducked the fade. Now, I see you talking about, oh, I didn't duck no fade when the boxing glove broke. We don't care about no gloves, my nigga. No, they said what, huh? Hold yeah, this, yeah, hold this. Hold this down right here, man. And you know what I mean? Don't yeah, even worry about them niggas. When yeah, niggas call business. you back, you know, get them niggas the cold shoulder, uh -huh. Do the Mayweather on them. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> the Mayweather. We don't care about no damn boxing gloves, my nigga. This is not Golden Gloves. This is not the local gym night. This is not fight night. We don't care. If y'all was gonna box, that's cool. But once a nigga puts them motherfucking hands up, calls you a bitch, and says, on oh, my son, I will whoop your ass, and swings on you, the nigga swung on you. I don't know if it connected or not, but the nigga swung on you, period. I'm just saying. All of those bets is off. All that glove shit, all this other stuff, that shit is off. It's off the table. That's it's, it's for finito. And Piranha, I'm gonna tell you the why. The reason why you getting a lot of the clout and a lot of attention that y'all niggas is getting is because the way you talk, you be on spaces for 28 hours a day, talking crazy, talking about when Jack and them niggas couldn't come to the shy, and this nigga couldn't do this, and she couldn't do that. I remember, I don't be in spaces, I don't talk about them a lot. But I vividly remember, I keep telling y'all, I just said this shit the other day. You niggas want clout, but y'all want to control the clout that you get. You cannot control the algorithm you get. You cannot control the clout. You have to be there for good and bad. He got away with it. But he ain't get away with it. You can't just always be all good. 
You see a, a lot of other niggas with the same scenario. When you want the fame, you want the notoriety, you want to be talked about, this is what comes with it. This is what comes with it. Y'all can say, oh, I wasn't covering bags and bodies. Nope, nigga, I covered the other events, so I don't want to hear shit from y'all. That's why I said, don't text me, don't call me, don't hit me up on the DM. I don't want to hear it. I covered the other event. I was one of the only niggas that covered the other event. Do you know how big this fucking channel is? I don't have to cover bags and bodies. I don't. Y'all on Coastal Rain TV, I'm on TV TV. I don't, let's not do that. So y'all niggas talk crazy, remember, I'm on TV, nigga. The, 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 the network. I don't, you know what I mean? So let's not do that. I'm covering y'all shit still because I want to see y'all grow. I want to see y'all develop. I want to see y'all move as battle rappers. I want to see y'all continue to do things. But when this type of shit is happening, I'm hearing nigga talking about click, click. I got my gun right now. Piranha, as a man, if a nigga wants to fight you, he's swinging at you. You got to go get a gun. This is how people lose their lives. I don't got no cut for none of these niggas. That's why I don't be around these niggas. I do my own thing. I take care of my kids. I come and go. I work and I pay bills and I pay people. I don't want to be around none of these niggas. You got to go get a gun and you bringing that to Hitman. You in this? I'm in the mansion right now. Cling, cling. My nigga, you indicting yourself. How much self snitching is going on out here? You willing to shoot this nigga over some battle rap shit because he wanted to fight you as a man? That shit's whack. The nigga, you on the phone, you calling people, and I'm gonna call this person and call. A nigga's live action swinging on you. Live action, and you backpedaling and backpedaling and backpedaling and backpedaling and backpedaling, and this nigga's calling you a bitch and saying, oh my son, I'll kill you, oh my son, I'm gonna do this. And you gotta get a gun for him? Oh my goodness, bro. Put your dukes up like this. First of all, your hands was crazy. Like, did you have your thumb between. <laughs> did you have your palms open when this nigga. You didn't even have your shits up looking like it was really like that. Like, you supposed to protect the right, protect the left. You supposed to have your shit up there like this. He throw one on. Give him that shoulder roll. That way he work on your shoulder. Then he throw that up there too. You put him. He hit that. He come in and you close that. Come on, bro. What the fuck y'all doing? Nigga got his hands up. And he said, the man said, I'm going to let you get one. And walked up to you with his hands down. I'm going to let you get We don't hear about that glove shit, Parada. I'm sorry. We do not want to hear about the gloves. We don't. Let's go even further. So Hitman Holler himself has to jump in here and talk about what's going on, and talk about you saying that he wanted to smash the chick in the house. You know, it's always a problem. Whenever there's chicks in the house, it's always an issue. She said that nothing went on, so I'm gonna leave that there. But you know what I'm saying? Like, you going against Hitman. And I'm hearing more rumors. I'm hearing Snake Eyes got beat up again. Like, how many times? I need to get that nigga about that. <laughs> I know you don't like me. I really don't give a fuck. They need to get that nigga about that. <laughs> hey, yo, what the fuck? They gonna keep hitting this nigga from the blind side, man. There ain't no rules in fighting, nigga. I'm sorry. I don't got no beef with you. I really don't give a fuck about nothing you got going on. You do your thing. It is what it is. But nigga, you keep getting in the fights. Then nigga go, choo, choo. they gonna hit your ass from the blind side every time. You never gonna see it coming. That's why that shit keep happening. What is this, your third fight? Nigga ain't got here 0 and 3. <laughs> Leave that fighting shit alone, man. Y'all might as well just stick to the raps, man. Y'all niggas might as well just stick to the raps, cause. They put out a fight with a little KD in the other joint. He didn't look good in that joint either. All these rappers, all these fights I see keep coming out. None of these niggas don't look good. I'm not John claude Van Damme, but you know, I, I, <laughs> I'm 6'1", I'm 240. I can, I can handle my own if need be. But I, I don't, I'm not going to be out here like goddamn John claude Van Damme or Anderson Silva either. But <laughs> it get busy if it got to. You got to have your hands up. Why is your hands down? So the nigga chases him all the way up to... The nigga chased him all the way up the hill. Piranha's doing this. Oh, it's all good. It's all good. It's all good. I got you. I got you. I got you. I know what that means. If he had his gun on him, he would have shot him right there on camera. He would have shot him right there on camera if he had his gun. And that is the problem. Hitman Holly, you got money involved with this. You got a network involved with this. I know what it's like. You, you violating the NDA and all this other shit. Like, what is it, bro? You saying you don't give a fuck about the NDA and the Hitman Holler was trying to smash this chick and that. 
Piranha, man. You, you, it's not gonna work. Like the battle rap shit, the battle rap shit probably not gonna work for you. You've been in battle rap since you came in in like 2013, 14, went to jail for a little while, was in and out, you could never get along with a league, you ruined your relationship with the biggest league out there. I know for a fact, I spoke to them niggas like two weeks ago. No Mercy was on the phone with me. Them niggas is not booking you again over there. They will not book you over there again. Matter of fact, they even went as far to make sure that there was extra precautions in place at the event where you said you was going hook to do to do to do. You niggas could read, you got me, you know what I'm saying? The Cans Blazer, did you read the fucking translation? I'm not saying it, you know what I'm saying? Put it in subtitles. At the last event where you were supposed to uh 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 uh, they made sure that the uh 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 was in place to make sure none of the uh uh uh. All right, so you can't go on URL. RBE probably not gonna book you because ARP, he might not say much, but he sees everything. He see all this shit going on out here. There ain't no way he gonna have you nowhere near that bricks or none of the shit that he got going on because he's not ruining it. KOTD, I don't know if they gonna book you either. You probably can't even get across the border, you know what I'm saying? With shit you got going on, you can't get no passport. I know that nigga, you can't get no passport. Um, and then the Green Ranger, he's become a sensation in Battle Royale. I never even heard this nigga one rap one time and everybody's talking about the Green Ranger. All over timeline, Twitter, yada, yada, yada. She even made hoodies out of this shit. Smart marketer. Green Ranger was like, hell no, you ain't selling no hoodies with my name on it. And then she said, you know, I give you one for free, but that's about all I can do. They going back and forth with it too. But what I'm saying is this. Um, yeah, man, you got way too much money involved with this shit. I'm going to play you a clip, you know what I'm saying, of everything that you said with, with you and, and Bo at the end. But you got way too much money invested in this shit. You got way too much time invested. You got way too much going on. You on a whole TV network, big time network, wilding out. You on TV every day. You don't need to come down here and do this shit. I understand you trying to show love. You trying to help out the community. But bro, you can take niggas out the hood, but you can't take the hood out of niggas, man. You put them all in that mansion. You put them all there. They all come down there. They get the, the invite to the mansion. They be down there for like 20 days, 19, 30 days. They eat for free, they ride in sprinters. All they have to do is fucking rap. That's all they have to do. Hey man, take me off my job for 19 days. I bet you I go down there and rap. I ain't even no fucking rapper. Send me down there for 19 days. You want me to rap with A, O, Assault, Aerial, Air, I air it out. I, 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 I will, nigga, what? What? Man, I get hit with a half. Holler, my HK hit. Man, I'll be rapping down there like a motherfucker. For free? To be in, in sprinters and clubs, and these niggas don't appreciate nothing. You taking niggas that don't appreciate nothing and try to do something for them. I got a lot of love for him, man. I love what he's done with his legacy and love what he's done for battle rap. But at the end of the day, I got to keep it honest. Hitman, you promoting fights. You got to understand that you are promoting fights. You're the one putting the clips out. You're the one that's making the shit go viral. Your channel is where I saw this. Bags and bodies. This ain't no secret footage where niggas had filmed it on the side. You put this out, and then you put this out the day after all of the easy and fucking uh, nothing happened and all the reaction. You put it, you threw that shit into the algorithm, so you made it a topic. It's the 4th of July, you put that shit out. Of course everybody's going to be talking about it. Of course everybody's going to pick up on it. Yeah, yeah, you know Battle Rap, they want to talk about the negativity, negativity. Man, the negativity get way more views than the positivity. I break down battles, I still talk about events, I still recap shit. But I know I can talk about some bullshit and do 30,000 way quicker than I can recapping a battle. And I still will recap the battles. But yeah, that, that, this whole shit is crazy, man. Like, nobody wants to see y'all boxing in gloves for money and shit like that. Especially Piranha when the niggas talking about he swear to your kid and his kid or somebody else's kid or kid up the block that he'll sock your ass. Man, listen. <laughs> You better you be, fuck getting sent home. <laughs> it, that getting sent home don't mean nothing. Nigga embarrassed you. It's nothing prior. There's really nothing you. I don't even know how you can really justify it. There's really nothing you can say in correspondence to it. I don't understand what the comeback is. We all seen you on camera, backing up, backing up, backing up, You're backing up. Nigga, you backed up. You you backed up a hill. I don't even know how you got up the hill. You went out the joint and went up the hill. Then the nigga said I'm gonna kill you, and the dude runs out the park after you to go. <laughs> But I told y'all in the beginning of this shit, do not fight niggas with colored locks, dog. Once a nigga is willing to go get their locks colored, now I ain't talking about no natural color like honey brown or fucking platinum or blonde or no shit. I ain't talking about that. When a nigga go get their shit dyed, a color that ain't regular, you don't fight them niggas. Niggas with purple dreads, blue, green, you leave them alone because they don't got it all. I promise you. I had locks for like almost two years now and 
the niggas who got their shit colored, they don't got no sense. They they don't. They don't. I I I know the process. I've been through it. I'm still in it. Any nigga that's willing to sit there and get their shit bleached and yo, I'm on purple. You know what I'm saying? Purple don't match with everything you gonna wear every day, but I still want purple. Y'all know me, I be dripping now, nigga. My jersey match the chair. Yeah, I'm that kind of player. So I can't have no hair that match one shit every day, but these niggas don't care. They will put, they don't give a fuck. Nigga will have lavender dreads and will be wearing that shit with fucking black, white, purple, green. Don't care. Any nigga who do that, he don't give a fuck. Green Ranger, I never heard you rap. I hope you good. I hope you good. Now I hope you good. Because you getting all the attention and all the algorithm. But yeah, hey man, y'all got way too much money involved with this shit. If you promoting fights, no people gonna talk about it. You cannot, y'all, guys, like I said, and I'm gonna leave it here. You guys cannot put shit out there, let us see it and consume it and then want to control the reaction. That's why I said in the beginning of this video, don't call me, don't text me, don't DM me, don't tell me nothing about nothing about the bags and body. I don't want to hear nothing about it. You put it out there, it was on your channel, it got your logo in the bottom corner, I can talk about it. I can't use no two minute clips, but I can use 10 seconds because that's the way YouTube works. So it is what it is. And matter of fact, Hitman, I'm on your side. I actually got issues with the nigga that y'all do, do, do at the gas station. This nigga trying to sue me and shit like that. And he's sending paperwork and trying to get my name and, and motherfucker blah, 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 blah. So I, you know what I'm saying? I already took a, took one for you. He ain't gonna sue me. I don't give a fuck about the nigga. You know what I'm saying? He, all I know him for is getting beat up. So that is what it is. But, um, yeah, y'all gotta stop, man. All these fights and shit. I don't know why I'm here. This nigga's gonna be up again. I don't know why. You know, he don't have to like me. I'm cool with it. I don't give a fuck, but... Yeah, I heard he got beat up again and spit on. Like, what the hell is going on down there? Y'all need to get that shit together down there. Uh, I feel like it's a good idea, and I heard it's a good program, Bags and Bodies, you know what I'm saying? But it's just way too much drama. The two biggest episodes or the two biggest times people are checking for your show is one last year when Bad News beat the shoes off, dude. And now you got this year where uh, <coughs> this man's running after this dude up the hill. He knocks over the chick. The chick is about the pepper spot. Oh, my God, yo. Shout out to Asiya Mora. Um, good, good peoples, man. She from Chicago. I know she ain't wilding out like that, but battle rap is battle rap. You know what I'm saying? Um, people hit me and had to say, I'm getting the fuck out of here. Y'all have a great day. So you a hot head, you fuck up events, you do this, you do that. I'm gonna keep it real. Should I bypass that? We gonna be a hundred. You gonna know saying you gonna try to get this money. You gonna, you know what I'm saying? Further your career. What should I do? He said, man, hey, man, you know, they, they hate on me. They this and that. It ain't that. They uh, pay me to be a bad guy. This, this and that. Boom, boom, boom. I'm ready for it. I said, that's all I need to know, nigga. Welcome to the team. You got a battle, such and such, such and such. You win, you get in the house. He said, I appreciate the opportunity. I said, no doubt, nigga. Boom, hang up. First combo ever with Piranha. Boom. He get to the house. I mean, he get to the battle. He win. Boom, he in the house. Cool. He come in and holler, I appreciate it. Any more advice, you know, you can give me for this shit. Boom, boom, boom. You know, I just keep it straight. Like, nah, you know, just keep doing what you're doing. Just try to calm down all the, you know, the extra rah-rah with the dick. Cause that, that shit don't lead you nowhere. Ain't no leads going to book you. You know what I'm saying? You burning bridges. and ain't even that many top leagues to be paying the kind of money that you can make a career out of in battle rap. So it ain't smart to bring the ride. Niggas ain't going to book. Just calm down. Play it cool. Do, let the battles talk. You know, I'm, I'm talking to Piranha every day like that. You know, he come to me every day for, the, for advice, uh, advice like that. Cool. Boom. First challenge. Bags and bodies. You got an owl. Alphabet. Niggas up here getting busy. Boom, boom, boom. Bad news. Boom, boom, boom. Niggas are getting busy. Nigga, Piranha walk up. Didn't say a word. Couldn't remember. Nothing. Didn't say a word. Didn't say one word. Couldn't remember one word of his rap. Pulled him to the side. I ain't tripping, bro. I want you to work on your memorization. You know what I'm saying? I know it's tough. A lot of niggas don't know how to prep in an hour and work. I ain't mad at you. But I need some effort out of you, bro. You know what I'm saying? I want to see you come up and really do these challenges. I want you to, you know what I'm saying? I need you to work, bro. I appreciate it, bro. You know, I just, I, I ain't never, I ain't never did that, bro. So I couldn't remember. I'm like, cool. You know what I'm saying? It's all love, bro. I ain't here to, you know what I'm saying? I ain't here to bark on you. I'm here to get you better. So next challenge, I expect you to do a little better. You can remember a bar. I need you to at least have four or six bars. It's me. How the fuck am I helping somebody I'm jealous of trying to get out the house? If you came up there and didn't speak, and didn't spit one word, from my hour rap, I can send you home if I'm ready to send you home right now. I encourage the nigga. Are you all right, bro? You got it? That's first, That's the first challenge. This this, this from somebody who said I've been scheming to get him out the house from day one. And this first challenge, he didn't say one word. The only nigga in the house who didn't say one word. A word. 
but I want you out the house. That only makes sense, bro. It's cool. I talk to him on the side. He get past that. Cool. Next challenge, you do a little better. I told you, nigga, you got it. I appreciate the love, holla. You a real one, man. You've been solid since day one. Told the whole house that. You've been solid since day one. Our first conversation, you've been solid. You've been you one of the most solid niggas in this shit. But now all of a sudden, I've been scheming to get you going from day one. That don't make sense. You lying on me. For what, bro? I ain't even these battle rappers. You're not even competing with me. What do you add me into this shit? If you're going to beef with all them, beef with all them. What are you throwing me into this little shit? If you have nothing I could possibly be jealous of or scheming to get you out, I brought you here to pay you. Why would I bring you here to pay you and I'm jealous of you? That don't make sense. Cool. We move on. He get into it. Um, You know, I, I, I when I go, uh, when, usually when I leave and shit, that's when the house get lit because I'm here. You know, niggas be just like a boss. You know, you heard you, you chill. You on best behavior. You ain't really fucking up. You trying to chill. Cool. I leave. He get into it. Man, man, Piranha here tripping. Piranha here tripping. Marking on Yogi. Blah, 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 this and this and that. I'm like, yo, you know, I already, you know what I'm saying? I'm like, I know y'all going to be arguing. I know y'all going to be doing this. But, y'all, I told y'all, bro, it ain't going to be none of that. So if y'all want to get in the gloves, get in the gloves. You know what I'm saying? But ain't going to be no pulling up, calling niggas, pulling up guns, and none of this shit. This piranha getting the tool with niggas. They want. I mean, real early. Then again, there's somebody he said, I want him out the house. It's another incident where I could have easily, like, man, you already starting trouble leave. I put that video up. Yogi wasn't even on that. And Yogi... Ain't scared of soft or nothing. He barking on yo, you bitch ass nigga. Fight, bitch, doing all that. I ain't put him out the house, y'all. But he just swore it down. I'm the nigga that been scheming and get him out the house. It's on my page. Go on my page. He did that. Shouldn't I put him out the house for doing that? No, nah, I didn't. Because I like it. All right, nigga, you Detroit nigga. You talking that shit. Boom, y'all get in the gloves. That's another situation. We move on. Cool. Back. Nigga, I come, I come to the crib one day. They outside. They uh we playing basketball. Green Ranger Piranha get into it. Green Ranger told a nigga on my son, I do the on yoke son, I you know he's barking. Piranha get you know what I'm saying. Piranha knock his hat off. They they doing all that. They get into it. The nigga tweets, oh this bags and body shit scripted. They told us to do that. <laughs> That's a lie. First of all, it's NDA. You're not even supposed to be saying nothing like of that nature. And then it's a lie. I didn't tell you in Green Ranger to fight, fake no fucking fight, bro. I've never once said that. And, and, and I could have put you out for, for breaking an NDA. If I wanted you gone, you'd have did something else again that I could have sent you home for. That's the third thing already. Did I send him home, y'all? His tweet price still up there. This shit fake, y'all. That was a lie. What'd I say? I had a meet. Hey, y'all. I don't know what y'all on, but you know, y'all know the NDAs. Y'all don't supposed to be tweeting shit like that. And I don't know who told y'all to do what, but I ain't tell none of y'all to fake fight. I ain't on that shit. Do I look like a fake fight, nigga? Ask anybody in the house. If I, did I tell y'all to fake fight? Whole house like, nah. I said, all right, so I don't know why the tweets like that. He like, my fault. You know what? Yeah, boom, boom, boom. Cool. Let that slide again. Him and him and Yogi, um, after um, after that, nigga, uh, everything was cool. After him and Green Ranger had that situation. And I post and I told them everybody, I said, look, I'm not here to promote y'all fighting. I don't want y'all fighting. I want y'all rapping and talking shit, you know what I'm saying? Entertaining. I said, but if y'all fight, I'm gonna post it. Anything that happens outside of what I'm telling y'all to do, I'm gonna post it. Nigga, KD and Gorilla fight. I I got they only had a little bit of footage of it, but the footage I had don't make KD look all that. He from St. Louis. I posted it though, right? Yeah, you know why? Because I told everybody I'm posting it. If y'all fight, I'm posting it. I don't give a fuck. I'm telling y'all not to, but we gonna, I'm going to sell some. I'm going to make some money off of you. If you break the rules, I'm going to make some money off of it. I posted Gorilla and KD. KD like, I understand. Them niggas understood. Cool. Bad news is fake fault last year. Then I posted y'all. you damn right I posted it. Hey, y'all, look what's going on in the house. I told niggas I'm posting it. I posted the first clip. So I, I want to let y'all know. He told y'all that it was scripted, right? He said, yo, it's scripted. They told us to do that. But then he just tweeted, oh, Hitman pro knew what he's doing posting that first clip to make me look crazy. How can I post a clip to make you look crazy if you just told everybody it was fake and I told y'all to do that? That don't make sense. I never said that. What you What you mean? You just said, you said Hitman. I never said that y'all told us that it was, that it was scripted. I no, never you just said, said you tweeted, Hitman, you tweeted, um, that shit was fake. They told us to do that. It's scripted. What you tweet? 
I probably missed. I mean, I probably misworded your tweet about you. But what what was your tweet? Read your tweet word for word. I, I never. I never. I I, I I said it was scripted. I never said that y'all said that it was scripted or. Told us to do that for the camera or some or something like that of that nature. No, I didn't. But what, I, I, okay, I, I what, what was scripted? Okay. Like, anybody got a problem? Y'all you know what I'm saying? Put it on the floor, yeah. and and I and, and you like who 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 got a problem with who? Yeah, and I'm like shit, that shit was scripted, and then Green Ranger was like, that shit was scripted to me. I feel away, but that's after the and fact. I turned bro. around, like, that's after the fact, and I turned I turned around like, what you mean, bro? Like we we literally both agreed. Hey, Anderson out here with the camera, you know what I'm saying? Let's 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 act the damn fool, y'all. You and you and the security thought we were serious when it was over with. You you saw us walk away together. Nah, nah, yeah. nah, hey, no, nah, listen, no, listen. holla, bro. That's cap, bro. Only reason, only, only, only cap, reason bro. I shook your hand, cause cause we wasn't supposed to put our hands on each other. So when you smiled, I'm like, fuck it, I'm gonna smile, cause I think I, I dead ass wasn't trying to let my nigga holler down. So I'm like, I'm because I talk exactly. Head. So let me just calm down real quick. And I smile, bro. But when we left, I was telling everybody in the crib, like, bro, that's not scripted, bro. You knocked my cap off, bro. That's not, you know, that wasn't scripted, and bro. And you said on your son, bro. If you, if you, if nigga, you, I put if that you, on your like son. I, like, I ain't like put I that I on said, my bro. son. I put that on your son, nigga. Tell him the truth. That's what I'm saying. You said on your son. How's so that scripted? Me putting it on your son, though, Piranha. I put that on your kids. I beat your ass. That's not scripted. That's we never went saying. to the cut and said, let's do this. See you. Listen, listen. No, we. It's 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 the time to be. Honest and real green, not all the bruh, hey, bruh, bruh, hey, hey, look crazy than I already mind, look, bro. bro. You you when you are her captain trying to be tough, bro. I didn't come out there on no tough shit. You knocked my hat off, bro. That's why I pushed you, bro. And, and I said on your kids, I, I beat your ass, and you want to say, haha. No, camera you on. said no, oh my I was always first, bro. All right. All right, so look, oh, wait, let me mute her. Hold on, wait, 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 wait. Let me oh. let me shut up. All right, so look, so look, I let me finish. But start, okay, cool. You thought it was scripted, cool. But what I'm saying is, you tweeted it was scripted. What I'm telling you is, when we was out there, that shit one. I I thought you niggas for real. I didn't tell y'all to do that. I, I'm not even promoting that. So what I'm saying is, that was still against some shit you weren't supposed to do. And if I really wanted you gone, what I could have did? I right, you tripping, man? You you messing up NDAs? I sent you home. I'm just going off the tweets that you saying. I really want. I was scheming to get you out the house. I'm just telling the fans how much love I showed you day in day oh, out, you and you know that. Man, look. I never okay, once okay, okay. So, no all right, so I, I bet. So I'm gonna keep but, going, right? Boom. And, and you so, and you and you got it, you got it backwards. That happened first. That 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 shit with me and Green Ranger was like damn near day two, day three. I didn't get into it with Yogi my first day. I didn't get into it with nobody my first day. He the nigga that got into it with a nigga over a bed his first day. I didn't get okay. Well, I probably got I probably got the, I probably got the timeline wrong. You got two with Green Ranger, then you got a two with Yogi. Okay, my fault. I probably you got two with Yogi. Yo, cool. All right, whatever, but I'm just trying to go to the timeline about showing just because you're a tweet because you know damn well, bro, I'm trying to scheme and get you out there. You and I know that, Piranha. This is me talking, bro. You know that. So when when that happened, I right, fast forward. Everybody kicking. Everybody rapping. You doing better in challenges. Niggas is skinning up. Niggas is winning money. Everything good, bro. Cool. You sat down next to me a couple days ago, bro, and told me what, Piranha? What did you sit next to me on the couch and say, look me in my eyes and say, bro? It's like it's like four or five days ago. I said, I want to go to the crib. You say you want to go to the crib, right? Why you say you want to go to why you say you want to go to the crib? I, I miss my son. That was the first thing I said. Uh-huh. And and shit, I don't I, I don't know. I don't I don't know if this, you know what I'm saying? Nah, go I'm ahead already, and say it, Piranha. Just be real, bro. Go I'm ahead and say it, bro. Race. I don't I, this is what I'm saying. I'm already out the race. I don't mm -hmm. know if I don't understand like my purpose here. I don't understand like what purpose I serve here no more if I'm out the race. And that's when you broke it down. Like, well, you, you ain't in the well, race. Well, no way. You, you, no you, left off, you, left you left out some. You left out some. You left out some. You said, bro, I'm not really, I'm not, I'm not really doing too good. I'm forgetting the challenge. I'm not really doing that good. Oh, yeah. I, 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 yeah, yeah, come yeah, on. I said that okay, too, okay. Yeah. I I bet. So now, nah, listen. You know, I'm not gonna cap. Like I thought I was. That's cool. I, I, I know. I know. I ain't listen. I'm never gonna cap on your name, bro. One thing about him, man, bro. I'm never gonna cap, bro. I'm never. I'm not gonna make you look some kind of way. I'm only gonna be what's real. I ain't gonna get on here and lie on you. You told me you wanted to go. You ain't think you was cut for it. It was harder than you thought, boom. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, all that I shit. You missed that. your son. Cool. Okay, that. cool. What What I tell you, bro? Then I tell you, nah, nigga. You need to come. Oh, I need you to. No, 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 no. Let me, let me explain. It's my turn. Let me just tell you. I've been in spaces all day. Let me just get this out. Pause. I say, bro. I said, Piranha, but you got talent, bro. 
I say, you going home 12 days early, I say, that's just really defeating the purpose. I say, building your brand, nigga, you get here for 12 days, you can win about eight, seven thousand more dollars for your pocket. That's for your son, right? I'm like, you can still win money, you leaving. I say, nigga, you can mess up your, you might have a viral moment these next five days, nigga. Build your brand. You Anything can happen. I say, you not being on TV. I said, nigga, you got a boxing scene. I said, the fans gonna want to keep seeing that, so you just disappear for 10 days. That ain't smart. I'm like, nigga, you wanted the stables on the show because you got a drama, you got boxing. I'm like, nigga, show your talent. I say, nigga, you already know if you, you know what I'm saying, these challenges, I'm giving out $1,000 a challenge, $2,000 challenge. I said, you can win two in a row, nigga, you up 4000 You say, you right, Holly. You know, as you break that down, you right. But I'm just saying that to say, why would you tweet, I've been scheming to get you out the house, Piranha? That's I not kept the you tweet. in the house. That's not the tweet. Well, oh, oh, okay. Then you said I was. I'm, I've been scheming because I'm jealous. Because I'm trying to fuck Asia, and you, I think you. Come on, man. You know me, bro. I'm hit man, bro. You think I'm? I'm mad at you because you fucking a battle rap. Oh, I think you fucking. I'm mad at you, bro. Me, bro. Come on, bro. You know that ain't. You know that ain't real. That's cap, bro. I, I walk around twenty million fucking wilded out girls. You think I'm gonna be mad at a battle rapper because he fucking a battle rapper? And I, you think that I'm gonna put you out? I'm jealous of you because come on, bro. Don't cap on me like that. That's all I'm saying, bro. I've been real with you since I met you, bro. Don't tap on my name like that. That's all I'm saying. Bro, you know you can look me in my eyes. I can tell you to see your face, bro. It's me. I ain't lied to you one time, bro. And I'm getting on the internet and you capping on my name for what? Because you mad at them? This them, nigga. I'm the nigga that, that have, I have my hand out for you. That's me. Hitman. I put money in your pocket. When all them league owners told me don't book you, I brought you in. It's me. Why cap on me? Only thing I said was that you made you was make y'all was making me look crazy with the clips that y'all did put out of me. Ain't none of them. Man, you made yourself look nigga. crazy. All the clips right, so, made me look crazy. Hold on, Frank. So, so, hey, so keep it a hundred. Didn't I tell y'all I was posting every clip, no matter who the fuck was in oh, it and how they did son. it, if it was fighting involved. Then I then so, I say so that for the yogi shit just now out. Because I didn't want to put the yogi out because you look like a bad guy, and I was gonna say that for the I was gonna say that for the show. But I'm, that's what I'm trying to tell you. If I would have put that yogi clip out with all the other shit, you would have looked crazy. I was already just gonna look crazy, bro. But no, you look no, bro. If I put the yogi shit out with you barking on a nigga, pressing a the nigga, then the other clip where you ducking the face, that look crazy. That's what I'm trying. I never try to make you look crazy. I told you I was. I you got to you got to co-host Capo. Huh. You gotta get a co-host. Uh, I ain't gonna even. I ain't gonna even lie to you. I'm saying though, like, how am I ducking the face from a nigga that I asked to throw the gloves? But but, I, but I'm talking about the footage, bro. I'm not. I'm talking about the footage. I'm talking about the footage that's out. That's if all I would put... know, how am I ducking the fade from a nigga that I asked to throw the gloves? I don't want no if you, if you gloves. Said, you, you told me you're going to kill me, bro. Listen, no more hold gloves on. when you tell me you're going to kill hold me, on, bro. Hold on. Piranha, I'm hold sorry, on, holla, bro. Hold on, bro. Hold on. Hold on. Let, me get, let, me get my, let me get my thought across, bro. When Hit, 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 when hit brought the glove, he said, I, I'm hip to the fights and shit that's been going on. Ain't no more than this. It's, it's this now. And I'm panicked. So who, who going to be the first niggas to throw these bitches on? Did I not step? Did I not step up, Holly? Hey, and, and you, you you got in the gloves, and I paid and I paid.